Hey guys, what is a Macintosh here? And this is just another one of my little vlog videos. I haven't made one of these in a long time, but it's summer now and I have things that I can do. So anyway, this is my Dell Mobile Precision M4700. And basically I used this as my main school computer for a while. And then school banned my MAC address. And it was kind of not practical to take something this big to school anyway. So I went to school and everything using mainly my Nexus 7. So I used this for all my school stuff for a while. And that was fine for the rest of the year. So I thought that I should install Windows 8.1 on this because that's what I have on my desktop and it works really well and everything. And the Windows 8.1 on here just really sucks. So I put Windows 7 Home Premium on it. And Windows 7 Home Premium I guess would be fine, but I have the upgrade disc and not the regular disc, so my product key doesn't work and it's just a hassle to have to try to activate it all the time and stuff. So what I did was I pulled out this hard drive, which I believe was the original hard drive that was in the Precision, which should already have all of the drivers installed and should also have yeah, obviously be activated. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that it, you know, is the right hard drive with throwing it in the precision. And then if it works right, then I'm going to clone it onto the 840 Pro SSD that's in there and it should be fine. Because I really haven't been able to do anything with this in about three months now. Okay, so I have the original hard drive installed. I guess it would help to put the battery in. And yep, I can tell that this is the, you know, original hard drive. So once this finishes doing its thing, I will take this out and put that along with its SSD in my desktop and clone it. Okay, so now we can take a look at my super ghetto cloning setup. So right here we have the 840 Pro there. It's just plugged in with the cables that normally go to the optical drive. And then if we come around to the other side, you see the momentous thin hard drive which I just plugged in with an extra SATA cable and like a random SATA power that was dangling off of my wire nest back there and uh, I really don't care about this hard drive so that's why I'm not really taking any precautions with it but the 840 Pro is what's going to hold the info right there okay so here you can see all the hard drives that I have right now this is the original hard drive from the Precision, this is the Momentous Thin, and uh, this is what I'm going to be cloning, the main OS partition. I'm going to be cloning that to my Samsung 840 Pro SSD onto this partition here, and these two will be taken up again once Windows 7 is copied over. Come over here, you can see it again, the SSD, what's going to be on the SSD is everything in here, which is you know Windows 7 Pro with all my drivers and everything and uh, so we're going to go ahead and open the software here we're going to go into clone disk clone we want to clone the 300 gigabyte disk here we're going to want to put that onto the 840 Pro like that we're going to optimize it for an SSD we cannot do a sector by sector clone because there's not a real purpose to that anyway and also I'm cloning it to a smaller volume.
So now it is going to clone. This may take a while. And after that, it will all go back into the Dell Mobile Precision M4700. And I'll actually be able to use it again. Okay, so we're almost, I guess, probably about a fourth or fifth of the way through here. Take a look there. A few minutes, about six minutes apparently, I will be able to use my cloned SSD. Okay, so here we can see that the disk clone was completed successfully. I'm going to go ahead and click finish. Close this. Alright, so now we should have the two identical drives. Of course, they're not the same size, so they won't be exactly the same. So we have this one and this one. We have the OS partition on both. So I'm going to go ahead and take the 840 Pro and put it in my precision, and we'll see how it goes. Over here, so here we go. We have the 840 Pro and the Caddy here. We're going to put that in. Alright, so we have that in there. Now we're going to put the battery in and make sure everything works. Alright, so here we go. We're still going to skip the disc check just for now. Alright, so now we should be able to log in. Alright, so now we should just be able to go into here. Alright, there we go. We have the SSD installed with Windows 7 on it. All my drivers and activations are there. Of course I'm going to do some cleaning on this and give myself a little more space, but of course this does have all of my applications already installed. So yeah, that's about it. There's of course the inside of my custom build which nobody really sees on YouTube yet. And this will be the last video with two monitors because I just ordered a third one, which should be here in a few days. So now I can go back to using my precision. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.